What is up guys? Welcome back to another episode of CA Builds. If you guys are new here, don't forget to subscribe, turn on the post notifications so you guys don't miss out on anything. Today we're back in a Jaguar. If you haven't seen the previous videos, go check them out. We got a Jaguar from Copart. It had some damage to the bumper, to the side over there. We already did a whole bunch of work on it. We're gonna continue today. Today I actually want to focus on the interior. We're gonna get the airbag replaced. We're gonna do the seat belt. We already got the seat belt repaired, so we're gonna get that replaced. And then we're just gonna start working on the front end. We're gonna still have to take off the bumper, take off the headlights, get it ready for the paint shop. So I start working. No. So our battery is actually completely dead. I need to take off the roof. It'll be easier to put on the seatbelt, the airbag. Now we gotta try to jump it somehow. We got jumpers connected. I actually put two pairs here so we get more power. Let's see if it'll start now. All right. Oh yeah. That's so loud. Need to get the roof opened up now. Ooh, window actually goes down good. Check that out. And it's down. All right, we're good to go. I'm gonna start with the steering wheel airbag. I'm gonna put the little plastic part, this part on first. Then we're gonna throw on the airbag. I already got the new wiring on there. Then we're gonna move the seat forward and start working on the seat belt. I got the little plastic on. It's looking really nice. Now I actually have to take off the battery harness off, make sure the airbag doesn't blow in my face. So let's disconnect the battery and put on the airbag. Check this out. The airbag is on. All right. That looks so sick. This steering wheel is really nice. All right, the airbag is on. Now let's get this seatbelt in. We have to move the seat forward and somehow get it in there. Check this out guys, the seat belt is on, everything's working good, we got all the plastics on, it was a little hard to get that back plastic on there, but I got it on, everything's good, we got our airbag in, now we want to take it for a little test drive before I take off the bumper and the headlights, so let's go rip it a little bit. Sounds crazy. It sounds so sick. All right, now let's see. Give it a little pull. Let's just take it around the block. All right. This 
This thing sounds crazy. We definitely need some alignment. Check out the steering wheel. Alright, let's go back home. Alright, we got back home safely and check this out. I just realized that you press that button and look at this. That's so sick. So basically the spoiler comes out. That looks so dope. Then you press it again over there. Boom. Again. That's so sick. All right, guys, airbags are on. The seat belt is on. Now I have to take off the front bumper and the headlights. I have to get the bumper off, all the grills, everything off. So when we get it to a paint shop, they could just sand everything down and start spraying it. I got the bumper off, that was super easy, and I think I'm actually gonna leave the headlights on for now. Cause look, if you pick up the hood a little bit, there's a lot of room over there. So basically they can mask around this and we don't have to take the headlights off, I think. If I will have to, there's just a couple screws I could take them off at the shop already. But I think they can mask it down and even put the hood like that, and then they'll be able to paint it. That's good, now I just have to take the whole front bumper apart. Basically all these plastics and grills have to come off to get it painted, so let's do that. Man, this bumper is made out of about a million pieces. There's so many wires, sensors, plastics, grills. And there's still a whole bunch more stuff to take these off, take off the main one. I'm not even sure how this one comes out, probably piece by piece. And then these as well. There's just so many plastics and so much stuff going on here. But let's keep on taking that apart. Just like that, the whole bumper is taken apart. We got all the little grills off, got these little covers off. The bottom grill, the main grill, is basically stripped, so it's ready to be sanded and painted. And check out all these little pieces from it. All these little grills. The main grill is made out of like five different pieces itself. Wires, sensors, everything. Everything's off now, and it's basically ready to go to the shop. We got the fender that needs to be painted, the door. We might be blending this fender. I think we will because of the different color and it's like a straight line over here. So you're probably gonna see the color difference, but I'll still talk to the painter, see what we'll be doing here. But it's basically done. There's nothing else I can do today. The interior is basically complete. Just this door needs to be assembled and I'll be doing that after the paint job. But everything else is looking really good. All right, guys, we're actually done for today. We'll be taking a car to the paint shop tomorrow. So I'll catch you guys then. All right, guys, a few days have passed, and of course I got sick again, but the tow truck should be here any minute to pick up the Jaguar. We're going to take it to the paint shop. We made it to the shop, and this is the last time you guys will be seeing the Jaguar like this. Next time you see it, it should all be one color. All this should be repaired, and everything should be looking beautiful. That will actually be a wrap for today's video. If you haven't yet, make sure to hit the subscribe button, turn on your post notifications so you guys don't miss out on anything. We have some awesome plans, some awesome builds coming to the channel. You guys don't want to miss out on it. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.